My second favorite uh, Gronk story, actually. My favorite Gronk story, and I literally have it in my favorites on my phone, so this is actually hilarious. I screen recorded my favorite um, clip of you speaking. You were talking about, speaking of all this trade stuff, you were talking about when you almost got traded. <laughs> and it's literally the funniest video I've ever seen in my life. The laugh that you did at the end, bro, like that was, oh my God. Just, a, I wish I was on set for that. Yeah, that that was uh, that was a heck of a story for we sure. And uh, I still remember it to this day. And that was actually wasn't live either on Fox. It was uh, a little segment on the side. It's kind of like when you go to YouTube K with the, with the three minute break and then you're just talking and, and messing around and that's what we were doing we were just talking and messing around they're like hey this is a segment going on facebook do you have any stories about any trades or you getting traded and you or you declining a trade and that just popped right up to my head and uh, i remember and everyone here's the thing about it speaking of the trade deadline is that everyone thinks i rejected the trade because it was to the detroit lions but that actually wasn't really the case i was rejecting the trade no matter what the situation was or whatever team I was going to. And to tell you the truth, the Detroit Lions were going to pay me as well. My agent called me. He's like, hey, Drew Rosen, he's like, hey, you sure you don't want to go to Detroit? Like, they're going to, you know, you yeah. you know, back up those trucks. They're about to pay you some cash. And I was like, no, like, I don't want to play anywhere besides New England. So it wasn't because it was Detroit. I just wanted to stay in New England. Gotcha. Yeah.